Alright, welcome back everyone. In the last part, we headed to the Dragon Scar, and we're on our way to Babel. We met Tifa as well. Uh, let's just start our episode with the usuals. Ooh, he actually has five points. So we can get Sling, yay! Sling, sling, shell. A victory upon winning a battle, we saw the little HP to life. That's pretty cool. Um, you got four. Two, probably nothing. So yeah, we met Tifa and she punched a dragon for us, which is uh, always handy. Um, what was I aiming for here? Shock spells, life spells, uh, okay, cool. Uh, Tama, no. Um, actually, let's go back to him again for a second. What did he get? He got all Sonic Train, all Sonic Train, uh, did I? He, got, he did get Blizzard, okay. Um, okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to come down into the Babel region. She said her town was north of here, didn't she? Yeah. Wait, I think I can actually see it from here. Ooh. Something about that place makes my fur the crawl. I don't know what it is, but it gives me the heebie the jeebies. So it looks like uh, the reactors and stuff. So, what we've got here? We've got three areas. What's. Oh, there's a town here. Is this Diebelheim? That's. Uh, I think that is actually Midgar. This is. I oh, know. That is. That, a Garth here. I'm not sure if there's anything here for us, but we can have a look. Well, this is a charming little town. But something feels kind of, I don't know, off about it. I can't quite put my finger on what it is. Hmm. I think it might be a good idea for us to keep a low profile around here. Why is that? Because... Okay. Low profile, Tama. Okay. Roger the wheel, Cole. Okay, I did see a chest somewhere around here. Where is it? There is. Um. Girls, I. Yes, yeah, so we missed one. Somewhere. I'll find out where it is. <sighs> huh? What do you want? Don't talk to me unless. Uh, okay. Hey, what you got? hey, did you know about the nimble mirages living in the desert? They're really fast. I'd really like to run a race against them one of these days, but... Well, they're mirages, right? I don't want to start a race with them only to have them attack me, so I was hoping you could check out how strong they are for me first. Oh, they're called cactuars. If you can defeat a handful of them for me, then I'll be able to tell how strong they are. Yeah, sure. It's pretty random. Uh, okay, so is there actually anything here? Well, we've got the girl's diary entry 4, I'll read that in a second. Uh, I just want to have a look around. See if there's anything else. Doesn't seem to be. <clears throat> Maybe we'll come back here or something for a quest? Uh... This is a sacred place. Yeah, we must come back here, okay. Um, okay, so before we continue, let me... It's in key items. I need to find girls, diary entry 2. Six of granite, granite, mithril 9. Once again, one went to work first thing in the morning and still hasn't come home. Today was her birthday. So the two of us were planning to make her dinner. So much for that. Isn't there anything we can do to help her work less hard? Um, I am gonna, I'm gonna take access prism case. Um, what have we got? We've got.
Um, I'm going to swap you out for... I don't know where it is. That. I'm going to swap it out for you. Just because we are coming to a fire area. And I do want to have more ice magic. It gets blizzard straight away. Stroll. Okay. We'll save up for those. Alright, let's head on up here. Are you guys seeing this town? Yeah, that's where Tifa lives. It makes Ninewood Hills look the humble. If you get confused during battle, you lose control of yourself and start. You can bring a confused fighter to his set. Here. Oh, thank you. Let's go to Nibelheim. Chapter 11 Crimson and Azure. That's a cool remix. I like how all the uh, logos do look like Final Fantasy VII's logos. Oh no, the honeybee in. Hang on a sec. Hmm. I don't see any chain on the place. Well, maybe they're like Cornelia, and they haven't been annexed by the Federation. Good point. Sorry, huh? Corn. What? It can't oh, be. Nice. Great memory hmm? there. Hey there, guys. It is you, right? Hey, super punchy girl. Hi. How are you doing, Tifa? It's so good to see you. Same here. Hey, I have to ask, what are two keepers and a mirage doing way down here in Babel? Oh, yeah. I guess we never told you, did we? <coughs> oh, good. I was starting to worry. What if I accidentally saved a couple of bad apples from the Bahamut army? It's weird. Why does everybody keep thinking that we're Bahamutian soldiers? I don't know. I guess they don't see many Mirage Keepers anymore, unless they're working for the bad guys. Yeah. And not just Keepers, Giants too. These days, they all seem to be fighting for Bahamut. I guess it makes sense in a way. They say the Federation conquered their homeland long ago. Dude. Still, the prophecy's a hot topic around Nibelheim. Everyone in town has heard of the giants from the hills. Uh, I'm not sure I like being a celebrity. <laughs> anyway, so you're looking for the Valley of Fire? Unfortunately, that's the only real clue that we've got. The Valley of Fire. Everyone knows that bit. But no one's sure which valley is the right one. What do you mean? If you're looking for fiery valleys, this region is full of them. But that's just it. Any one of those valleys could be the one the prophecy is talking about. Oh, right. I forgot there's a summoner in town doing research on the valley. She might know. All right, so let's uh, head around. Uh, what do you want? Excuse me, I'm sorry to bother you, but I was wondering if I could ask you a favor. You see, my grandson's birthday is coming up soon. Is there any chance you would... Oh, thank you. I You're welcome. It's not much, but... Um... Physics, physics. <laughs> thank you. Um... Let me just grab the hits. Earth hammers, okay. And then you can see that we have another Final Fantasy Ready character here. The giants from the hills. <laughs> yeah, that's us. Hello there. I am the summoner Ridia. So we have Ridia here from Final Fantasy IV. Hmm? 
something here is not right. Something about you. Hey, you know, the way that Mirage follows you, you totally remind me of Yuna. I guess it's because you're both summoners. Huh? You mean you know Lady Yuna? Yeah, we met her, back on the Upper Continent. She was really a lot of help to us. We might not even be right here if Yuna hadn't pointed us in the right direction. Oh. Well then, I suppose you can't be all that bad. There now. You hear that? These two say they're friends of Lady Yuna. That means you can trust them. For the time being, at least. So let me get this straight. You're searching for the four keys recorded in the prophecy? Yeah. We came to Babel because we heard one of the keys was hidden here, in the Valley of Fire. Right. But, you know, the keys are part of the Crimson Prophecy. Crimson Prophecy? So wait, you mean there's more than one version? Yes. There used to be a single prophecy, the Azure Prophecy. It only spoke of four sigils and said nothing about keys. It was much more abstract. The Azure Prophecy is heresy! Uh, this is no business of yours! Lies! Only the Crimson Prophecy is gospel! <laughs> Are you a summoner or not? You should pray that fate guides you to the Crystal Tower. The Crimson Prophecy is clear. Flanked by mirages, the Chosen Ones shall acquire four keys. From the Crystal Tower, they shall mount the heavens, where God will grant them the gift of eternity. So long as you know to look for the signs, the keys shall be found. So do as the Crimson Prophecy commands of you. Hmm? <laughs> it's random creepy people just appearing out of nowhere. Ugh. All you hear these days is that nonsense. Yeah, no kidding. At least they're not breaking any laws or getting violent, but it's still creepy. What do those fools know anyway? The Azure Prophecy was written by the first summoner. It's the Crimson Prophecy that came later. The whole thing is nothing but a sham. Still, that sham seems to be the prophecy folks believe in. Unfortunately so. That's why I came here to sort the truth out myself. Tell me then, why are you searching for the keys like the prophecy says? You see... So you're telling me that your mother shares the same name as Lady Lucifarna? And you're looking for the Herald's Castle to find her. I get it. If you really are the giants from the hills, all you have to do is follow the prophecy, and you might wind up there anyway. Right. There's actually more to it. Someone told us we would find our family as long as we kept collecting mirages and pressing onward. Hmm. Well, whatever the case, it seems the only way to prove which prophecy is true is to accompany the two of you to the Valley of Fire. In a way, you'd be accompanying me and doing me a favor. What do you mean? Oh, never you mind. So, are we ready? Uh, are we ready? We don't even know which valley to go to. I've already figured it out. The valleys of Babel are numbered, and I believe the one we are looking for is Valley 7. All right, Placey Place, here we come. Now you're forgetting entire names? All right, so we're going to be going to the Valley of Fire. I don't know if you can do anything with these places, because... No. Okay, what do you have to say? Hey man, you wouldn't happen to be a giant. Oh wow, you and your sister both? Um, oh, is there a... No. Okay. There's a gate there. Do we need it? Uh, do do do. I'm gonna set... For now, I'm gonna set her Mirage to the bat. Oh no, it's a tap, sorry, it's not that one. To that one. Um just to give us access to Blizzard. Valley seven is east of the here. Uh, I do want to level up our shark wall. I think it's level 20. So I can get it to its large form, then I'll start sorting out our mirages and all that. 
Um, charge towards trying to reach level 20. It's cool music. <laughs> Alright, so we're going into the Valley of Fire, number seven. So what we got, we've got a few areas to go to. Um, remember right, there's a lot of nooks and crannies with uh, areas to go to. I don't, I can't even remember what sort of things we find here. Probably bombs and that sort of stuff. Uh, Alrighty, let's well, go. Come on, <laughs> All right. Um, let me just see. So what are we weak to? Actually has a resistance to eyes. Uh, use fire type to create prison unity. Oh, so our enemies are actually weak to water, not ice, okay. Um That's annoying. <laughs> um okay, uh I've got some memory, pick me up, flash bombs, smelling souls, fish scale. I bet I don't have the uh item for fire. No I don't, of course I don't. Because I took time off my team to for the ice bat, and then it turned out that it's wrong. Okay, um, let me just get rid of you. This is it. Oh nice, so we only need to get it up one more level, got a drop bomb fragment, oh that's handy. I think that's the, actually the fire item. So we don't necessarily need uh... One wrong step and we're finished. <laughs> Why are you sneezing? It's like 500 degrees in here! Uh, so I have to go. Right, so what's over here? I know there's an item of some sort, but what do I need? Okay, I need to do the uh... Um, oh, okay, so I have to do that and then it makes a bridge down there, probably. Uh, let's see who we got here. It's a back attack, that's kind of... Are they the, the blood eyes again? Yeah, the blood eyes, oh. or whatever they're called. <laughs> Comes in handy. Okay, these are the ones I had last time. Blood eye, yeah. That I cannot remember what they're weak to. I believe actually they're weak to ice. They're fire. About the weak to water. Oh, they're confused. Okay. Uh, no, I'll just. Uh, okay, so I don't need the ice mirages then. I just need ones that have water. Okay, 
trying to hurt itself. Oh, it doesn't get rid of confusion. Okay. So there's probably no point in having the Ice Bat on us then. Or the bonnet, Pale Bonnet Berry. Or Baby Pale Berry, that was it. Because uh, I thought it was... Um, ice was going to be very helpful and it clearly isn't. Fire resistance for 50 or greater. made a thing appear there. Um, okay, well, the ice idea just didn't really pull off. What I might have to do then is I might have to go collect some water-based ones and just have them because I don't really have any... As far as I know, I don't really have any water ones. Oh yeah, I do, actually. I know what I can do. Um, okay. Um, oh no, wrong one. That one. I think I caught one. The uh, that plant. That was water. Awesome. Okay, so if we can go get that chest, and then I can go back to the gate and do that. I mean, there's loads of enemies in the um, Rainbow Coast that I didn't get, which would probably be handy. Um, in this area. Uh, Okay, fine. Okay. Really? Is that the one that... Ah, oh, okay. Um, I think I don't know, let's just take this out then. I've got a lot of health. I probably need to go and get some items anyway, so... Um, a jag jaw, probably for a gimme golem. So it's good. I, it's a good job I came down here. Um. All right. What have we got? More bombs. Uh, let's get rid of you. All right. That wasn't so bad. Uh, this way. Let's go back. I'm going to try and go to... I think I do have... The... Um, what do you call it? The plan. Right. Okay, let's just get rid of you as quickly as possible. Go away, go away. I do have the plan. But I do want to go over to... The Rainbow Coast, see if we can find anything else that has water on it, because the only real one that has water on it is the Shark Wall and um, the Flan. Uh, 
so having another water might actually be beneficial. Um, let me just access that. I do believe uh, I ha I do have that. Yeah, there. Mini plant. Which should have water, I believe. Uh, let's just travel back. I do need to get irons anyway, so what I'll do is I'll cut it here. Alright everyone, I'm back. Uh, I decided to cut it here. Um, just because uh, I've got the mini plan, so I can try it with that. Try and get that water and things and see if that helps us out a little bit. It's got three points, it's probably going to need water. Yeah, fours, water, balance, resource stability. Gelatis body, less physical damage, taking for rates of magical damage. Alright. So we're going to take him with us. And it's on rain stack, so she can eventually get water. I got some more potions and I got um, do -do -do -do, some fire fragments as well. Or bomb fragments. So we can use fire on a bomb and hopefully catch it. Let us go. Yeah, that's the gimme go one. Yep, so we were right to do that then. Okay, is there anything there? Go, 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 gotcha. Now, go for it. All right, uh, let's just take out one of them. Maybe she's not doing enough damage now to <laughs> to do it. Uh, let's try the bomb over then. Hopefully, it won't. We've only got two chances to try and catch it, so... We got it. Awesome! Look at that flat. Awesome. Get a bit of gill back as well. A classic FF baddie, prone to use self-destruct. And neither friend nor foe is safe when it does. Watch out, perhaps many of your players painful memories of this mirage for one reason or another. <laughs> okay, so... Looks good, and we'll just send it back to the, uh... Leave with Seraphy. Alright. Yeah, that's what I want to check. There's only items here. No. Okay. So we got that. That's cool. Oh! If you've got a patch of water... You want to walk over, a Mirage's chill ability is your best friend. It even works on lava sometimes. Pretty amazing, right? You can use a chill ability anywhere. Don't forget, a Mirage must accompany you with... If you want to use a spe special ability, take the Mirage you need to... At this prison gates at the time. Does uh, Mr. Bat get it? Probably not. Okay, let's get water for you. Restore stability. Sticky game inflict magical water damage and slow. Uh, I'll probably get that because it gives us more abilities, doesn't it? Water abilities. Um, does the bat get chill? Probably not. Plank space strength. Da -da -da. No. I bet I haven't got anything with. Uh, unless the pale berry has it. So back I go again. <laughs> uh, it's probably not that important to have it right now. We could come back for it, but I just kind of I just want to get it if I can. Come on. All right, let's just uh, okay. Thanks. Chest Thunder, what a sticky goo. Play magical damage. And slow. It's a decent amount of damage, so. Alright, let's get rid of you then. Before you uh, blow up on me. Oh, 
awesome. Um, yeah, I didn't really check if the Paleberry had uh, chill. Probably doesn't. But I hope it does so we can get some more items. Uh, save access prison case. I could have used it. I know I can use the Seraphone, but it's just it costs a lot of money to get another Seraphone, so I'm just like, no. Um, let me. Where's Paleberry then? There. Not transfigure. Uh, sub menu, view abilities. Yeah. It doesn't have it. Um. I actually don't have anything with the chill ability. Uh, that's kind of annoying. Uh, the ability is... Hmm. Do you definitely not have it? Yes. Okay. Well, I'll have to come back for that then, because I don't have anything with the chill ability. That's kind of annoying. I thought at least one of the... Uh enemies that or mirages that I captured would have had the chill ability. I won't hold back. Right, let's do Okay, let's just get rid of you. Oh. Okay, let's go. I'm trying to think of, uh, the only one I can think of is the, um, the Shiva might have it, but that means I have to go off to the cave and try and find it and hope that it doesn't run away from me and hope that I can run away from it because <laughs> I need uh, the flea ability to do it. Um, Get that because it'll be handy. Um, okay. Okay, so we have his second farm. Which is called what? Zafir. So we, once we start getting everything off here, we can. Uh, we don't really need to transfigure it, which is fine. Um, Fifteen, two. Okay. Um, Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this part off here because um, I do want the chill ability so I can get through and do stuff. So I'm going to go off and try and find the Shiva and Ifri baby forms and see if they can help us out a bit. Uh, so thank you very much for watching everyone and I'll see you in the next part. Bye!